Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for three months from now. So three months from the date that you watch this reading. So you watch it in April, May, June, July. So July. Okay, so Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, three months from the date that you watch it. Um, if if you watch it in May, August. But keep in mind, not every reading is for you. Okay, this reading may or may not be for you. But this is just a prediction. So let's just see what comes up. What do we have for Aquarius three months from now? What do we have for Aquarius? One card, please. Hope. Is that not your card? What card is this? This is the star card. <laughs> Unbelievable. So this is your card. Uh, I think that you will be shining very brightly, obviously. Um, this is a renewal. This is beautiful. Very beautiful, beautiful energy. Um, this is also unexpected help, guaranteed success. Uh, this is a wish being granted. So yes, I mean, you're going to be shining very, very, it's like your prayers are being answered. Okay. Three months from now, uh, something that you asked for, um, is happening by the looks of things. This is, this is, this is your fairy godmother granting your wish, but it may not be in the way that you envisioned. You think about Cinderella. She envisioned the pink dress. It wasn't pink. It was blue. Okay, that's just an example. So it looks like, you know, it's an example that it's not, your wish is going to be granted, but it's not going to be in the way that you envisioned. Okay? But you are definitely going to be shining very, very bright. You're going to be glowing by the looks of things. Um, you're going to be in a very beautiful spot, put it that way. Um, so if you're starting to lose hope, don't. Don't lose hope. Things are going to, things are definitely going to be okay. Um... You may have a new purpose, okay? You may start to see things differently. You, obviously, there's some prayer that is being answered, but like I said, it's probably not in the way that you envisioned. What do we have for Aquarius, please? One card. These cards are hard to shuffle. They're so big. Ace of Wands, starting with a clean slate. Okay, look at that. That's a, that's a blank canvas. Okay, and it's exciting. This is an exciting opportunity. You may get the sudden uh, new vision. And there could be a new desire, a new spark. But either way, you're painting a new picture. You're starting with a blank canvas. You're starting with a clean slate. Okay, and it looks like you have the... Um, you know, this is the pen, right? This is this is the paintbrush. You're painting a new picture. You're painting a new story. Okay? So this is an exciting time. It's a time of fertility. It's a time of growth. You can create whatever you want. Okay? They're backing you up. Okay? You are being backed up by the universe. Seriously. Um, Interesting, Aquarius. This is very, very, very nice. Very positive energy. Um, I got one. Two. One more, please. You know, and these, this, this card deck is really hard to shuffle too. And, and I've been doing, I'm on the end of these readings and I haven't had these problems. So it's like it, you may be dealing with some hard times right now. You may be dealing with a lot of chaos in your life or things may seem a little unorganized, but things are definitely going to get better. Okay. You're going to come up with some, some sort of new vision, torch. Spiritual development, enlightenment, awareness, and understanding. That makes complete sense. Now, this is vibrating at a very high level, as you can see. Okay? You're going to be, oh, you're going to be putting out a very high, high vibration. Um, there's, a, there's some growth here. Okay? This is growth. So you're growing spiritually as well. You're becoming a new vibration. Your vibration, your energy has changed. 
And because of this energy change, you are starting something brand new. Hmm. Pineapple. Reconciliation. Now, reconciliation could be with anybody. Okay? Rainbow. The most difficult part of a situation is over. And that makes complete sense. This is the fresh start. Starting over. You're going to be starting over with somebody. Okay? Starting over. And, and I don't know if it's with somebody or if it's on a new path by yourself. I don't want to say it's with somebody. But reconciliation uh, does say somebody. So there there must be a reconciliation with somebody. It could be a friend. could be a family member. could be somebody that you were with um, romantically. But this is some sort of reconciliation. You've been through some sort of stormy weather. It's over. It's over. And this is a wish being granted. So there's some sort of wish being granted for you, um, which is interesting. Now, you got to remember that reconciliation could be with somebody that um, you haven't even met in this lifetime. It could be. It could be. Whatever's going on, there's something that is going to happen suddenly. It's going to be exciting. And it is the answer to your prayers. crack in my stand but I fixed it so I think you're going to be fixing something I do I think you're going to be fixing something hmm god damn it I don't know why it's doing It takes a little bit of extra hard work to fix it, though. I need some duct tape. All right. Ooh. You, I think the wait is over. You've been waiting for something. You've been getting prepared. The last three months, you've been getting prepared. Probably thinking it's never going to come. Probably praying, 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 praying. I mean, probably been praying. Praying for something, hoping for the best, wishing for the best. There's been some sort of delay. But I feel like the delay is over. The wait is over. I feel like um, you maybe, you know, this is not seeing the opportunities. Maybe there was somebody that was didn't have the, the foresight or they weren't seeing that something was going to come. But there's something exciting that is coming, okay? It's a very fertile time. Ooh, it's love. You may not have thought it was ever going to come, but it is going to come. Now, this is some some sort of love. Now, this could be a reconciliation. It could be a renewal in love. It could be a fresh start in love. Say say you were going through some turbulence. This is starting from scratch, starting over. We're going to start over. We're going to start over from here. There's some sort of reconciliation here with somebody. Um, somebody that you have been through. It's somebody that you have had some trouble with. Okay. Um... This is happiness. This is a flood of emotion as well. I think it's going to be a very emotional time. Ooh, Seven of Pentacles. Um, I don't know if there's going to be a relocation. You may be relocating. Somebody may be relocating to you, to your area. Looks like there's no growth here. Wherever they've been or wherever you've been, I feel like there's there's definitely a relocation. And this is somebody that you have planted seeds with maybe seven years ago. Somebody that you knew seven years ago. Something about seven years is very prominent. Now, like I said, it doesn't have to be a lover. But it could be. There's double loyalty here. There's dual loyalty. There's inability. There's blocked. Maybe this person was blocked from your life. They blocked you or you blocked them or something like that. Um, this is going to piss me off. Yeah, so this is something about seven years ago. There's been an inability. There's been an inability to uh, see the truth or to accept the truth or acknowledge your feelings. 
or on their part because this could go vice versa. Somebody was blocking their true feelings. And and this person it looks like this person is looking at this person blocking their emotions. They've been thinking about this person that blocked them from coming into their heart. They've been thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it. Ooh, it is definitely somebody from your past. So this is somebody that is very well suited for you. This person may be a little bit younger. This is somebody you, uh, that you knew before. So there is somebody, this is a reconciliation. You are going to have a reconciliation with somebody. I don't know. It could be a child. could be somebody uh, that you grew up with. Somebody could be somebody from seven years ago or somebody that you knew when you were seven years old. Um... But there is a new suitor, and this is exciting. It's like this person is 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 extending an olive branch to you, or you're extending an olive branch to them. So there is something very, very exciting that is, is coming for you. And I think that you have been torn. You've been torn. <laughs> or this person was torn. Somebody was torn. But there is going to be a reconciliation with somebody from your past. This person is, is very well suited for you. They are maybe a little bit younger. This person is very adventurous. They're, they're very passionate. They are going to be sending you a message. They're going to send you a message or they're messaging you now even. This is somebody that I feel like you um, may have had some sort of attraction to earlier, earlier in life. It's like, I mean, with that page of wands, it's like, this is somebody being brave, extending an, an olive branch. Somebody is definitely extending an olive branch. There's been, they've been trapped. Somebody has been trapped in fear. They've been trapped in some sort of situation that was keeping them stuck. Ooh, you may be dealing with a Taurus, because this is Taurus, this is Taurus. You could be dealing with a Libra. Um, we also, we have uh, Capricorn, Virgo. It feels like this, whoever this person is, um, is, knows their value. This is a value. This is value. This is somebody that is very valuable and perhaps it's you. You know, this is somebody who has learned some life lessons, has a lot of knowledge behind their back. Somebody that is, uh, can, is financially stable, is abundant. Um, is fertile, this person is fertile, this person is grounded, this person is a hard worker, very comfortable, um, a very uh, stable opportunity here. This person is valuable, knows their value. So we have a very valuable individual here that has been waiting. This person, this person has been waiting. They've been waiting to... Uh, share what they have but they don't just share it with anybody um i do see you starting fresh with somebody that you have known before this person is very abundant loving generous whoever this person is and, and this could be you whoever if you are the feminine because this is feminine if you are the feminine watching this you have somebody that is going to extend an olive branch to you they're going to send you a message they're going to give you an offer an invite they may invite you out you know they may invite to take you out whatever whatever if you are the masculine watching this the man then you are it looks like you're going to be communicating with uh a feminine that is very abundant. This feminine is, she has money. She's stable. She's solid. She's a hard worker. She um, knows her value. She has a lot of life experience. She's an older woman. This is an older, she's not young. She's not young. This one has worked hard to obtain abundance, okay? She has everything she needs. She's very comfortable. She's very outdoorsy as well. She loves nature. 
It's, it definitely could be an earth sign. It doesn't have to be, but I feel like she's a natural. Whatever she does, she's a natural. She can grow anything. She loves her garden. She has garden. She's um, also very fertile. So if you are younger, you know, whoever, if it, well, this is, it looks like it's an older woman to me. It doesn't look very younger, but it's a very fertile time. Um, there's something to do with landscaping here, perhaps, or gardening. So I just, I don't know why I feel like it's, there's something to do with gardening. Um, you know, for some of you, this person may be paying for a gardener. I don't know where that's coming from. This person has money. Whoever, this person has money. Um... Now, this is the start of a new life, giving birth to a new life after being in a painful situation. So we do have a new life that is beginning. This woman is very comfortable. She doesn't chase. She doesn't need to chase. Opportunities chase her. She's absolutely glowing. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. Not only is she beautiful, she's stable. She's got money. She's solid. She's secure. She doesn't need anybody to take care of her. There's a reconciliation for this woman. This woman that isn't, she doesn't chase. She knows her value. She's been through something very painful. Now there's a blessing. There's a reward coming for this woman. It's a reconciliation. It is a reconciliation with somebody who... Um, has been blocked or didn't see, didn't see their, they were ignoring their feelings. They were, they were, this is ignoring feelings. They were ignoring their feelings. Now there's a reconciliation coming. This person has been thinking about it. They've been in a dead end situation. This is a dead end situation. It's time to go someplace else. But they were blocking their truth. They were blocking their truth, but and waiting, waiting for something, waiting for somebody to get free, to break free from something. Somebody was stuck in a situation that they, that was very troublesome. It was very stormy. It was cold. It was, uh, it was safe, but it was uncomfortable. So somebody was stuck in that situation, but it feels like now somebody has has come along that is breaking them free they're breaking them free from that it's like this is such a exciting opportunity this is a it's very exciting i just i just i can't waste my time i can't waste my life so i think we have somebody here that is is um taking a new path to break free from something that was confining them because they got this better opportunity with with somebody that is very abundant. This person is very, very abundant. This is a, this is somebody who is nurturing, caring, loving. And it's easy to see. Wealthy. It looks like we have somebody here that is wealthy. So if you are this wealthy individual, looks like a feminine to me. Be prepared to receive a message that is is going to help you. This mess. This is a message from somebody who wants to take you out. I feel like this person wants to. I think you know who this person is. If you're the masculine, I think it's you. I do. I think it's you delivering the message. There's fear here, though. There's some sort of fear. Somebody that is trapped in fear. But they're going to be brave. So they've been fearful, but they're going to find their courage. They're going to find their courage to communicate. So there's somebody has been fearful of this abundant person, but they're going to find the courage to communicate. But they've been, it's like some sort of time has been wasted because they were dealing with, they were trying to make something grow that was already dead. This is dead. But now it's like you can't you can't pretend anymore. This is pretending. You can't pretend. So there, I think there's something that is going to happen that changes your your thought, your vision, right? Let's get another card here. How is this reconciliation going to happen? Um, yeah, there's going to be some sort of movement. Somebody's going to master their emotions. They're going to replace that fear with faith. And they're going to take action. They're going to communicate. There is some sort of communication that is coming. We have this person that is headed towards this empress. 
they're going to move or they're going to make a move. They're going to face their fear. So we got somebody here that is going to face their fear and they are going to move towards this empress. They have been very fearful, but it's like now they got to take ownership. They got to they got to do it. They're determined. They're determined to uh take action to to take that mask off and and face their fears. So Aquarius, I think three months from now, somebody is going to be, if you are the feminine, somebody is going to be heading towards you. This is somebody that you have uh, known before. It is. If you are the masculine, I think it's you. I think it's you taking action towards this person. I think it's you replacing your fear. And, and it's almost like you drive to this person's house. And you're in charge. And you take charge. It's like you see this person sitting there. She's so comfortable. She's so she's so beautiful. She's so easy. You know, not easy in a sexual manner. She's easy to get along with. Okay? She's laid back. Very laid back. This feminine is laid back. She's just sitting there. She's sitting on her chair watching you work or something. It feels like the, this has to do with work. And there's some sort of spark. This is a spark. The Ace of Wands is a spark. This is everything you've asked for. So I feel like there's going to be a reconciliation with somebody that uh, you're meant to be with. Put it that way. And and I think that when you when you get together with this person, you will you will consider it a blessing. You will consider it a blessing that whatever it is didn't grow, didn't grow. I mean, what's this? The pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. So if you are the feminine watching this, be prepared to have somebody enter your life that really sees your value. This person really, really, really sees your value and they will be determined to get your attention. Determined. If you are the masculine watching this, I believe that this is you taking action towards this empress who is beautiful. This person is beautiful. This person is laid back. This person, you feel you feel like you've known this person forever. You may be moving with this person. That you guys may be moving together, moving in together, something like that, or moving to a new place. Or you may, or there could be some travel where you you travel and you move. You move with this person. You move in with this person. Something like, or they move in with you. So Aquarius, I feel like you uh, have asked for something, maybe even subconsciously. And whatever it is that you asked for, you're going to get. And it's going to lead to success. Okay, whatever this is, this is, this is success. This is victory. This is going to break you free from something that has been... Uh, troubling you put it that way it's going to bring you out of this deep dark place that you have been this is deep and dark it really is it's a it's a very dark situation it's going to bring you right you're going to it's going to bring you right out of it so whatever is going on here it's beautiful and be prepared for an arrival if you especially if you're the feminine this is an arrival arrival of of uh somebody who really want is determined to uh take you out they're gonna they want to take you out and not and they want to take you somewhere they want to take you somewhere they want to go with you they want to uh they may uh, want to travel with you they want to go on vacation with you they want to move with you they want to be with you okay so be prepared to receive a message from somebody that is very well suited for you that is highly attracted to you and they are not going to take no for an answer that is what i got good luck